Hey FTC, so uh, Circuit Breakers here. So we were noticing at Super Regionals that um, we were having high ping with our Nexus phones. And we thought that we were asking FTAs, we were looking for solutions, we were changing channels. And in the end, we had to switch to our ZTE phone. Now, we found out today that the Nexus phones probably could have worked and there's a, a potential bug in the FTC software that we'd like to show you. So, over here. So over here, we have a um, Wi-Fi analyzer that's good detecting all the Wi-Fi signals in our current house. So right here, you see our two phones. So you see the 104.35.2, which is this Nexus, and this 104.35.S5, which is this phone, uh, the S5 phone that we have right here. We've also found that this is an issue with the S5 as well. So. Right now this one is on channel one and this and the S5 is on channel six. So if we had so if we want to change a channel, say this channel is too crowded, we were gonna go into our usual thing, we're gonna go to change Wi-Fi channel. And if you say, oh eight looks pretty good, I'm gonna change it to eight. Change it to eight, and then it's like, oh, it's just changed. I'm gonna back out. And it's gonna restart, and it should work. And most people think it does work, but if you look over here, this is still there. And if we wait a little bit, it'll stay there. Yep, just gonna stay there. So how you really change a channel, which is way more tedious than it should be, is you go in here, go settings, advanced settings, change Wi-Fi channel, and say you're changing it to six, you're gonna hit six, you're gonna go in your Wi-Fi settings, you're gonna turn it on or off, then back on again, and hit back, and then click six again, and then wait for this. So there's your phone right there. Wait for that to go away. You do not want to get off the screen until that has gone away. So just refresh this a couple times. There, so now it's gone. So now, once that once that's gone, you can back out of here and wait for it to start up. Once it started up, you can see that now you're on channel six. Now this also is an issue with the Samsung Galaxy. So if we want to set up a channel here. Well, you see, well, right now it's not on a channel, but it's not connected to anything, so we won't put it on a six. Wi-Fi settings. Off, on. Back out. Six again. I think you can just back out. Yeah, I think we just back out because it's not connected to anything. We don't know. There it is. That's five. All right. All right, now change the channel on that one. Yeah. You don't have to wait on that one, right? On this one? Yeah. Yeah, so change it again. So change channel 11. Yeah, let's change the channel 11. So channel 11, Wi-Fi settings, off, on, back out. And then change the sec 11. It's like again. And you don't have to wait on this one, you can just exit. Yeah, this, for some reason, only on the Samsung's, you don't have to wait for the for this period. You can just exit out. I can see it's gone away from our scanner here. And it should pop up. There it is. So if you reboot or recycle Wi-Fi on your Nexus 5, it'll swap to channels uh, 1, 6, or 11, or it'll go to 5 gigahertz, even if your Wi-Fi settings, your band frequency settings, have it set to 2.4 gigahertz only. If you reboot or swap Wi-Fi channels on your S5, you're only going to get, you're, it's going to automatically change to Wi-Fi channels 1, 6, or 11. Um, so. At, 
this is what we found. Uh, everyone's environments may be different. You know, we all like this is our house. Everyone has different hotspots, different Wi-Fi networks. Neighbors doing different processes. Um, your experiences may be different. Um, you different phones. Uh, yeah, your mileage may vary, but this is what we found uh, through our testing, so we hope this may be helpful. We're using uh, Android 6.0.1, so if you have any questions, you can leave a comment. You can visit our blog, circuitbreakersrobotics.com. Leave a comment on all of our posts there. So that'll be it for us. Thanks for watching.